Hey, what's going on, Trap Watchers? Man, today is the first day of October 2021. This is going to be our Matic Polygon price prediction. You guys can see we did one already. So we're not surprised to see what the market is currently going through. But we want to see since the since Matic's price has maintained itself, has its held support right there around a dollar. Is there still a chance for a 38% correction or a movement back down to lower prices? Guess what? I got you. Don't worry about it. We're going to look at the price chart for what it is, and we're going to anticipate where price is going to go so that we can eat off the market, so we can dominate, so we can beat the trap at its own game. So guess what? If today's your first time ever seeing our video and our content, you guys want to tap in with me, then hit the like button, share the video, and also subscribe to the channel. One thing I will not do, I will not come in and try to continually give you all of the hype, all of the FUD, all of the FOMO, and telling you that this market in Polygon or Matic is going to go all the way up there to $1,500. I'm not going to give you all that. We need to give you something more realistic in terms of how market dynamics really work. For anyone to give you a video telling you that Matic or any other cryptocurrency is going to shoot up there to astronomical numbers is ridiculous. We just need to simply see the chart for what it is, get in position and win. So tap in with me, all right? So now, let me break this down with you. Okay, you guys can see it. I don't hide anything from our community about what we talk about. You guys can see that we played the weakness in Matic right there on September the 20th. We told you all, be prepared for this price in Matic to go down. And take a look. What do you know? We told you precisely where the market was going to come in and hold support. Right there. So we had numerous opportunities for us to eat off this price in Matic, 14 and a half percent. You wonder why did we expect the price in Matic to go below this number, right? Right there around a dollar five. Because we understood back here in back here on the left side of this chart, it tells us where the market was holding support. It was already predetermined. So it didn't take a rocket scientist to understand that. Yeah, what's the chances? of Matic coming in and holding support at a dollar and a nickel. It was already established. So we already had a heads up. The trap already told us as the price of Matic was coming down. He said, hey, look, I've already shown you a dollar five is my last area that I came in and propped up the market price in Matic. And look at how he did. Look at how he performed. All of these training days, the market in Matic maintained a dollar five. That's phenomenal. We appreciate this information because he tells us going forward that a dollar and a nickel is still going to be support right now. So 14 and a half percent taken out the market, given to us, placed into our accounts. This is how you're able to win and profit into the market right there. So let me get rid of this. Let me get rid of this arrow. So now, again, what do we need to do with this horizontal line? I mean, what's the first thing we need to do? Since he's confirmed that a dollar and a nickel over these last couple of trading days is support, then the only thing we need to do is extend it. We now know that. So as long as Maddox price trades above a dollar and a nickel, guess what? We're going to continue to trade sideways at best. But the opportunity for the market in Maddox to go up is definitely still on the table. Just because he maintained price above a dollar and a nickel. Now, second thing, take a look at this. Take a look at this. What was the market price in Matic doing on September the 5th, right? That was the start of the downtrend. That was the start to where Matic's price was going lower and lower and lower. It was trading lower almost every day. But what's going on today? Take a look at this. What do you know? Matic's price is now breaking that descending line boom if that's not a mic drop that's telling you already that the price in matic is no longer going to be in a downtrend now give me give me some leeway because we still got 13 hours left and let's just say in the next 13 hours a big wall of selling was to come in and the price in matic closes well below the opening price of today's price bar then yeah we're still going to go down right but looking at the chart for what it is now, as of this recording, the market downtrend is over in Matic, at least for this time being. So again, this still confirms that the price in Matic is going to at least give us some consolidation of trading, at least. 
So now let me go ahead and clean this up then, right? Let's clean this up. So now since we're seeing a market price in Matic break this descending line, we need to go ahead and create our restriction area. Now, where do you think the market restriction is going to be in Matic? Again, the left side of the chart gives us all the information we need in regards to what the expectations can be, right? So $1.30 is the nearest area of restriction into the market in Matic, right? That is literally where we would expect to see an increase in selling of people trying to get off the market and take the bag and, and take the profit and go. It's right there around $1.30, okay? The second area is up here, okay? So we got a, a, a dollar thirty first. Second area is like around a dollar forty five, right there. Okay. Now you might see a couple of people give you all this information right here. That this is the overall downtrend into the market in Matic, which is plausible. I mean, I got to keep it real with you too. This is actually how the price in Matic is trading currently right we're seeing this market possibly giving us a longer term downtrend so what we're going to do right we're going to lay this out and we're going to use this as our gauge as to our expectation as to where price is going to go and what it's going to do once it gets there okay so now i'm going to do this because i like what i just did this descending line is going to be the all out tracker for us in the long term in Matic, right? Currently, we've came off and bounced off a dollar and a nickel. Now we're on an upward move. So I'm looking for the price in Matic to continue to go up, maybe around a dollar 40 towards this descending line. And as price gets to this descending line, we need to pay attention to see if the strength continues. Will they have enough momentum to break that descending line to the upside? Because if so, then this market in Matic is on a massive run. It's going to be on a pretty good upward move once that happens. But let's say we don't. Let's say we get rejected on that descending line again. Then we already know that we need to grab the bag, take the bread, and move on to the next play. We already know that. Okay? So those are the two things we need to look forward to as this price in Matic continues to go up in price. All right? So now, let me go ahead and run the play show you what my prediction is going to be in the market in Matic way before the price even gets there. We know that a dollar five, right? A dollar and a nickel is support. As long as that's the case, then we know that the price in Matic is gonna go up, right? Now, a dollar 40, you guys can remember I said a dollar 30 was the first area that we could see some weakness or selling up here. That's about 7.88%, right? A dollar 30. Okay, maybe around six. That's the first area that we need to keep guard. That we need that we need to be on the lookout. Right there around a dollar 30. The next area is a dollar 40. We'll come in and eat off the market there, which is 12 and a half percent. Then ultimately, right here towards this descending line, right? Is where we're going to expect the price in Matic to show us some induce weakness okay now let me bring this up slightly all right so that's it it's about 17 percent movement to where the price currently is in Madden. bring this down and that's it this is our expectations for the next couple of weeks right in the next two to three weeks this is what i'm looking forward to in maddox price now i want to know right you part of my team we help one another out. So drop me a comment right now and tell me what are you expecting Matic to do over the next three weeks? I mean, just take the opportunity to see if you can predict market prices without using technical indicators, without using none of that technical analysis jargon. You don't have to be complex and analytical and understanding one simple thing. Where's price going to go? So just look at the price chart clean and easy and simple and tell me. Make sure you maintain a profitability and as always, trade different.